The deadline to sign up for the new stimulus update, which gives free health care for six months, is August 15th, so don't miss it. Before we dive in, don't forget to like this video to help other people see it and benefit from it. And subscribe to the channel for more stimulus updates. Hey everyone, Karan from Life Accounting here, and I wanted to provide you with a quick stimulus update that was part of the Democrats' $1.9 trillion rescue package that went into effect in March. Yes, the same plan that gave $1,400 stimulus checks and monthly child tax care payments was just updated to now provide completely free health care plans for six months. Let's talk about who qualifies. In short, if you received or was approved for unemployment benefits in 2021, you are automatically eligible to receive free health care coverage for the rest of the year by visiting the healthcare marketplace, healthcare.gov. It doesn't matter if you receive one payment, two payments, or 20 payments. Even if you are currently working or off unemployment, you could still qualify. According to recent government reports, almost 3.5 million people are actively on unemployment, with thousands of new applications coming in on a weekly basis. And almost 11 million people were unemployed in January of this year, meaning there are literally millions of people who can benefit from getting free health care until the end of this year. According to the Department of Health and Human Services, three out of five eligible uninsured Americans will be eligible for the $0 healthcare plans, and an average of four of five current consumers will be able to find a policy for $10 or less per month. Now, there are typically limits to qualify for Obamacare coverage, but there is no income requirement to qualify here. The only caveat is that you generally don't qualify for any subsidies if you are able to get healthcare provided to you by your employer. Shakita brooks Lashore, who is the administrator for the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services, said the following, we're doing everything we can to remove financial barriers to comprehensive health care. She then added, the American Rescue Plan provides consumers with additional savings that will make coverage even more attainable for those most in need. Now, if you don't qualify because you did not receive unemployment payments, I'll provide a few unknown options for you at the end of the video. So how do you sign up for free healthcare until the end of the year? If you qualify, you will need to visit the revised portal on healthcare.gov and submit a new application where you enter personal details and information on your current employment situation or update your existing application. Say you've used healthcare.gov in the past and already have a login or are already receiving healthcare coverage through healthcare.gov. You will want to log in and select report a life change. You just have to demonstrate that you are indeed eligible for unemployment benefits. Once you've updated your application, you will be able to see and search for new options available to you. The $0 plans are not considered high-end plans, but are also not considered low-end plans either. They are somewhere right in the middle. Silver plans, and typically also come with very low or no deductible at all, making them even more attractive. For 2021, a typical Obamacare premium is about $452 a month, which is a huge savings for those who are paying out of pocket or cannot afford it at all. These free plans became available on June 1st, and the enrollment period ends on August 15th. So don't wait. Sign up as soon as possible if you receive or was approved for unemployment benefits this year. If you need help signing up, you can call the Marketplace Call Center at 1-800-318-2596 or by visiting healthcare.gov backslash find dash assistance. Note that some states like California do not use the Affordable Care Act exchange and use their own exchange with their own timetables. If you live in a state such as this, you should be able to sign up or update your information to get $0 or very low cost options in your state. All right, what if you don't qualify? Additionally, I want to make you aware of two other healthcare updates in case you were not aware or do not qualify because you was not on unemployment. First, Obamacare plans have long been criticized for being way too expensive. To help this, the Affordable Care Act made a change to provide subsidies where those with low income can get completely free healthcare and others will pay no more than 8.5% of your total income towards healthcare premiums. That used to be 10%. Secondly, those with income 400% above the poverty level 
can now receive subsidies for the first time. The enrollment for these subsidies started on February 15th and was recently extended by three months to August 15th to give you more time to apply. According to Kaiser Family Foundation, the relief bill brought in availability to 21.8 million people, including both insured and uninsured. In general, many of us were not aware of the provided subsidies. So to boost awareness, Biden has doubled the advertising budget to $100 million and has a new ad circulating that details the availability of no cost or low cost plans. I hope you found this update helpful. Do me a huge favor and like this video for me. By liking the video, you help it to reach as many people as possible. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more stimulus updates. I'm Karan from Life Accounting. Until next time.